the book. I need you to listen to me. Okay? I understand that you didn't know about the kids, and I'm sorry for springing on you, but I meant what I said. It didn't mean anything. A kiss always means something. Wait, maybe you're right, but it wasn't a romantic moment. And you would know that if... If what, I was there? As you so sweetly pointed out at the party, the party that I threw for you, I wasn't there, was I? Is it impossible for you to forgive me? I forgave you. For what? For sleeping with Chris Keller. And you know what, Lucas? I loved you for that. You had such grace in that moment that I fell in love with you all over again. I can't believe you're using it now as a bargaining chip. I need you to trust me and believe me when I tell you that my heart is with you. But a part of me feels like ever since we got back together, you've just been waiting, waiting to push me away. Oh, great. You kissed Peyton. Again, and I'm pushing you away. God, why don't they make identical purses for everyone as wedding gifts? I love you, Brooke. I don't know how else to say it. How about how you show it? I'm not pushing you away, Lucas. I'm holding on for dear life, but I need you to need me back. Okay, why didn't you tell me about the kit? Okay, and why didn't you call me when you were away? And why don't you ever just let me all the way in? <sighs> we have to go give her toast. About love. It's like you're pulling salt on my cut.